Are we looking at a preview of the Western Conference Finals? So far, the best two teams, not only in the West, but in the NBA. Chris Paul and the Suns riding a 16-game win streak. The Warriors above them in the standings have only lost twice. And look at Devin Booker in the first quarter. Booker's night would come to a quick end. We'll have more on that in a moment. Here's Steph Curry, a rare make for him on the night. Suns turn it over. Gary Payton to Jordan Poole in transition. He connects. Then Andrew Wiggins back to Poole, who had 16 in the first quarter, hit four threes. Golden State was up by six. Now Otto Porter misses on the three. Chris Chioza grabs the board, gets it to Curry. It's 48 to 39. Now watch Devin Booker here in transition. Chris Paul gets it to him. Booker gets fouled in the layup attempt. Appears to favor one of his legs here. He would leave the game with a left hamstring injury and did not return. So the Suns now a man down. They were trailing at this point, 48-41. Chris Paul hits the fadeaway. More from Paul. Threading the needle in traffic to DeAndre Ayton. Suns closed the half on a 17-6 run. Phoenix led it by two at the break, 56-54 more of Chris Paul, just a surgeon. Then Mikael Bridges doing it on the defensive end. Turnovers, a major problem for these Warriors. They committed 23 of them. But back on the other end, it's Gary Payton for the transition slam to tie the game at 75. Now Ayton again, the hook. Campaign over to Ayton. A monster in the paint, 92-89 Phoenix. Check out the ball movement. Jay Crowder, corner three ball. He knocks down the jumper. And then Crowder from downtown, 97-91. How about Chris Paul in the paint? That's pure. More from Chris Paul. This time looking for the dagger. Under a minute to play. Finds Landry Shamit. He's open and he buries it. The Suns tie a franchise record with their 17th consecutive win on what was statistically the worst shooting night of Steph Curry's career. Both the Warriors and Suns tied atop the West now. 